All right, welcome back on this Sunday. Hopefully you're having a good start to the day. It's time for two's pet project. Katie Fine from the Houston Humane Society is here. And this morning she's got Cindy. Good morning yes. to you guys. Thank you. Thanks for having us. All right. Uh, so Cindy is uh, the definition of a lap dog, it looks yes. like. Yes. <laughs> a yeah. little on the calm side. Yes, she is very calm. I think she's one of these dogs that will take a couple weeks at least in a new home to kind of like develop her personality. Okay. So um, Cindy was part of a hoarding situation. Mm -hmm. uh, so you guys brought in what, 33? It was 33 dogs and okay. one cat. Okay. Yeah, that the owners um, surrendered. So they came in through the task force, the Animal Cruelty Task Force, but the owner surrendered them to us. Okay. Um, they were all still in like relatively good shape, but all very, you know, skittish and unsure, kind of like Cindy. So yeah. they're still kind of um, figuring out what, what the good life is all about. but. I'm sure somebody will take her home and show her. Absolutely, absolutely, yeah. Cindy, I think, is going to have a pretty good home here, mm -hmm. hopefully by the end of the day or tomorrow. And speaking yes. of having a good home, we have an update that yes. we want to talk about. Yes, Peach. And uh, Peach, there's Peach. Yeah. What a sweet. <laughs> so I brought Peach wow. on um, almost exactly a month ago. I think it was August, the August 25th segment. And she was the one that had come in from another shelter. She had um, a bunch of puppies. They all got adopted, and she was left to fend for herself. And um, she got adopted the next day. Excellent, excellent. So yeah. this pet project segment works. I know. All right. And uh, <laughs> just to remind people, you know, we, we have uh, a limited number of dogs that we can bring on right. our show. But uh, there are a ton of dogs that need yes. good homes. And they're all just as cute as Cindy. Yes. Uh, so, yeah, they all need good homes. Now, uh, we just got done with a uh, big flood event yes. here in Houston. My dog does not like going outside in the rain. <laughs> My dog gets a little skittish, kind of like Cindy is yeah. here when it rains. Um, tell us a little bit about how to handle dogs in situations like that. Yeah, so dogs are very dependent on their, um, you know, on their routines. And so just like for us, rain can kind of be a downer. It's the same way with dogs. And so there's just some things that you can do to kind of help keep them secure. Um, the first thing is bring them inside. You know, like extreme weather, whether it's heat, cold, or rain, they don't deserve to be out there. Um, but also prepare for potty interruptions. So, you know, when it's not raining, you can teach them commands like go potty, which I'm sure we all say 700 times when we take our dogs out. Um, but it can also help teach them, hey, when it's raining, you know exactly what you're going outside to do. Exactly. Um, but you can also do things like put a... Um, you know, put kind of like an indoor potty area um, with some turf inside um, or like on your patio or garage mm -hmm. to give them a place to go and then obviously having potty pads inside. And then um, when they go outside, make sure that you're keeping their paws and their ears, um, their fur clean and dry so Very that good. they don't get, you know, get sick. Excellent. Good common yes. sense stuff. <laughs> yeah. All right. Good tips. Thank you so much for being here. You're welcome. And uh, if you are interested in Cindy or any one of the dogs at the Houston Humane Society, they are open today from 11 to 530. They're located at 14700 Almeda Road, Southwest Houston to see all the animals in need of a family in Houston. Check out our adopt a pet section at click to houstoncom It's under the consumer tab. Thank you guys so much. for being Yes, here. thanks for having us. All right, we want to take one final look at your weather today and here is a look.